In this video, I'm going to show you how to get your Elementor, Divi, WP Bakery, or other page builder built WordPress website from a page speed and site score that looks like this over to something that looks like this. Let's check it out. What? So I'm super pumped about this plugin. I have tried WP Rocket, W3 Total Cache, Auto Optimize. I even did a YouTube video that's gotten a, a decent amount of views on WP Optimize that got me as far as I was able to get. But a few weeks ago, I tried out Nitro Pack and I was absolutely blown away. In this video, I'm going to be setting up Nitro Pack and I'm going to show you the before and after of what we get. So this is the before scores that we're getting with him. The majority of this website's traffic is mobile, so we really do need to address this. On top of that, soon Google is going to be rolling out its core Web Vitals update, and I want to make sure that our website's ready for that. So a few weeks ago, discovered Nitro Pack. We're going to be setting it up on this website. So first thing I did was in install Nitro Pack. Need to go into the settings now. Have to connect to it. And it looks like it is connected. I want to use everything that it has, so we're going to use these page optimizations as well. Also, let's check this box for the purge affected cache when content is updated or published. I imagine that we really don't want to update content and then wait for Nitro Pack to get around to updating it. So right here we can keep track of what's getting processed. This is a pretty sizable website, so it may take a few minutes. And this thing has been still running, but it has optimized the home page. So let's uh, take a look at what the results are. So here I've got a 92 score on mobile and I got a 100 on desktop. So really a considerable jump considering where it was at the beginning and really solves this issue that we're going to have that we've been having for quite a long time as far as this stuff is concerned. So. Right here, just to explain what this is, this origin summary, this is the aggregate data that it has for people that have visited the website. You can see the, um, the numbers just really haven't been very good for a while. And this one was using, and this website was using the plugin that I recommended in my other YouTube video. Um, this one, on the other hand, you can see the lab data significantly better. Though I'd say that this website still isn't phenomenal. I mean, uh, we've, we saw a bit, we've seen bigger jumps with uh, our own Elementor website for Saga Pixel. I mean, these numbers are all like below a second. I'll probably illustrate that in another video. So lastly, I want to outline that Nitro Pack does have a free version, but it doesn't do everything that we're seeing in this test right here. So if we go over here, It'll show you that it has a lot of the stuff that is uh, shared here, but um, the minification and compression isn't done there. Um, and it looks like they don't really have the, um, the complete image optimization, which is also going to make a difference as well. So my recommendation is give it a shot. I mean, you can't, they do have monthly testing and they do give you a two week, uh, a two week money back guarantee. So if you want to try out Nitro Pack for yourself, they have a 14-day money-back period. You can get a refund if for whatever reason it's not working for you. But honestly, I have never seen anything work this well. I've been super pumped about it, and we're getting all of our websites onto it. Um, I have a link to Nitro Pack in the description below. If you get the same kind of results that you've seen here, please like the video, leave a comment, and if you're interested in learning more about SEO, web design, make sure you subscribe to the channel because we're putting up all kinds of great